In this video, I am going to introduce you to Mamba. Mamba is a new state space model architecture which shows promising performance on information dense data such as language modeling, where previous sub quadratic models couldn't match transformers. This Mamba model has been inspired by structured state space models. It combines a hardware friendly design with an approach similar to flash attention for improved performance. As you all know that these LLMs now power most of the exciting applications in deep learning and most of them are based on transformer architecture and also its core attention module. But the problem is that uh, more, many sub quadratic time architecture such as linear attention, gated convolution and also recurrent models and structured state space models have been developed to address transformers computational inefficiency on long sequences but they haven't performed as well as attention on important modalities such as languages. This is where this new project helps. This project has identified that a key weakness of such models is their inability to perform content-based reasoning and that is where they have made several improvements. First, they have simply let the SSM parameters be functions of the input addresses, which addresses their weaknesses with discrete modalities and that enables the model to selectively propagate or forget information along the sequence length dimension depending on the current token. Secondly, even though the chain prevents the use of in, uh, efficient convolutions, they have designed a hardware aware parallel algorithm in recurrent modes. And then they have integrated these selective SSMs into a simplified end-to-end -end neural network architecture without attention or even MLP blocks. That is where they call it Mamba. Another cool thing is which they have proven empir empirically that Mamba enjoys fast inference around five times higher throughput than the transformers. So also on the language modeling, their Mamba 3 billion model outperforms transformer of the same size and matches transformers twice its size. I'll drop the link of this GitHub repo in video's description so that you can read further along. They also have some installation instructions and how you can play around with it. For example, these are the prerequisites you need. And then all you need to do is to git clone this repo and then install the requirements. And this is how you can run the inference on this model and play around with it. In order to get the complete model, you can go here and use it Python script to download it. Uh, use it but if you want to use the pre-trained one you can go to the hugging face and i'll show you quickly and there you can have different mamba 130 million 370 million and so on and so forth so they are not only available in a very very small sizes but also in huge sizes too and for example there uh, this mamba 2.8 billion slim pj has been trained on 600 billion tokens on slim pajama data set and on your screen, you can see Mamba 130 million um, model card. And if you want to look at the other ones, these are all the state space models available at the moment on Hugging Face. And you can use any one of them. These are all pre-trained ones. So if I open this Mamba 2.8, this is how you can uh, load the model. And this is where, which I just showed you the GitHub repo of it. And now let me quickly show you how you can get it installed. I will be using Google Colab, but you can use any Linux instance. So go to your Google Colab, change runtime, black T4 GPU. The first step we need to do is to git clone the GitHub repo of this Mamba, which I just showed you, this one. So just go up, click on this green button and grab this URL from here. And this is what I have pasted here. So click on play. And this is, okay, so manage session. Let me close my other session. That's done. Now let's run it. I have double here. I should just mention one. Maybe I just can, okay, it is already running. Doesn't matter. Okay, that is good. Let's quickly check on the left-hand side folder icon. So Mamba is there. Now CD to Mamba. That is good. 
and now as a next step we need to install all of the prerequisites or in other words what we are doing here is we are building from the source so that everything will be installed press on code and then pip install dot and click on play here and that is going to install all of the prerequisites which are needed for this baba let's wait for it to finish should it take too long all the prerequisites requisites are done click on restart session click on yes and our kernel has been restarted so everything is now loaded and then these are the commands which you need to use so all we are doing it we are importing this baba lm head and then downloading this to about 8 billion slim j uh, model so click here and it is around 11 gb of size i believe i'm not sure if my google colab has that much space but let it run but these are all the commands which you need to do and then uh, to install it and then all you need to do is to run the imprint so let it start and then if it fails due to the space issue i'll just give you the command as how you can run the imprints Let's wait for it to run. So you can see that it is now installing this, downloading this model. So let's see if it completes or not. It was taking a bit of a time, so I cancelled it. Another way of running it is this with the entrance. So let me show you. So here you can see we are, all we are doing it we are generating this through Python and then you can even download it through this command and this way you can run a lot of inferences on the same model. Another thing you can do with this one and let me show you that command too. And in this command you can see what is happening and let me run it too. That we are calling this okay sorry I need to go into that directory and then run it from there and then I will describe what exactly I'm trying to do so you can see what is happening is that we are running this 2.8 billion model which is 11 gig and then we are passing this prompt with this top P and temperature and that you, as you can see it is not only generating the tokenizer by itself it is also going to download the model for us which is 11 gig and there you go so once the model is downloaded it will it is going to run that prompt and give you the answer back so now let's wait for this one to finish to see if it finishes or not so you can see that as i was dreading my session has crashed due to the whole ram being used by this model but anyway the commands uh, you have now and if you have any beefy system with plenty of RAM then you can try out these commands but all in all um, we have seen that what MABA is and how to install it and then run it on your local system and we have shown it in the Google Colab so this is it guys if you're still stuck having issues let me know and I'll be happy to help out and if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel thank you very much